Okay, so I realize we're practicing, we're just kind of enjoying ourselves here, but so make sure that we're, we, just need, we really need to make sure that we're still mentally imagining the shots and visualizing the shots so that we're getting good mental feedback. We're getting that extrinsic or I don't remember what they call it, but the, the right feedback so that when you're hitting good shots, you're kind of rewarding yourself and becoming more ingrained in your brain. Mm -hmm. So let's kind of maybe take a few steps back, get your normal routine so you got a good routine. Um, just visualize the shot and then fire away. Great ball. Could hit like a fairway, fairway wood, try to go for it, but we got a lot of bunkers, bunkers left, bunkers right, bunkers short. So I, the way I see it is, um, unless you're in a tournament situation where, you're in, where you need to make up some strokes, I would say just hit like a hybrid, so in between, so you can go right between the bunker and the, the fairway bunker and the green, and set yourself up for a nice little chip shot. But center of the pin green, this this green is hard to hit, so I'd say that's probably your best chance of scoring well on this hole. Okay. Great shot. You fading a little to your right, so that'll give you some more room to work with. Yeah, between those bunkers. Yeah, great shot. And now, rather than probably blasting a fairway wood over the green, when you have a tough chip coming back, now you hit your hybrid, and then you hit you have a solid lob wedge coming in. You can spin it, get it out, and get it off on the club, and get right in. Cool. 